A hiker is sharing a safety message tonight after several families witnessed a horrific repelling accident at a popular Utah County waterfall. New specialist Lauren Steinbrecher hiked up to the waterfall with this woman as she explained why this accident was preventable and the lesson everyone needs to learn. Yeah, that woman says she was watching a group getting ready to go off of the edge here at Battle Creek Falls. That first repeller went off right in the thick of the falls. What happened next led them to calling 911. Even on a family hike, Becca Fulmer is always prepared. Emergency safety on trails. When they reached Battle Creek Falls Saturday, Becca could see. Noticed that the water was a lot heavier than it has been in years past. She says they took some quick family photos as one group of repellers finished their descent. When a second group began, Becca became concerned. I noticed that she had nobody belaying her or at least doing a fireman hold watching from below. Then suddenly she had one leg under her and her other leg had come up past her head like this, like she was doing splits on the side of the wall. After that happened, she hung there for a moment and then passed out. And I yelled to the girl next to me to call 911 and I started running up the hill to go to the top. Her companions at the top had no clue at first what was going on. And she says no way to help. There were no proper knots to let her loose. And so her companions were at this disadvantage where they could watch her, but there, there was nothing they could do. And I have repelling experience. I have first responder experience. Um, I, I honestly thought that she was going to have a major head injury or possibly die. After about 15 minutes of that woman hanging, water rushing over her face and limp body, Becca says the repeller came to completely disoriented, but was able to let herself down. I was so grateful that she was because she was a sitting duck. The Utah County Sheriff's Office says they initially dispatched search and rescue, but called it off because the woman's friends decided to take her to the hospital themselves. Becca isn't sure how that woman is doing now, but she's hoping as others are headed into the outdoors. It's always important to be prepared. In addition to that repelling safety, Becca urges anyone as conditions look a little bit different this year, consider hiking safety as well. Extra water, first aid kit, and always tell somebody where you're headed out to. Lauren Steinbrecher, KSL 5 News.